For those of you that are thinking about painting your home in off-white paint color, it's a lot harder than you may think, and most homes can't pull it off. Instead, you may want to think about painting your home a grayish paint color. So, having said that, today's color review is going to be Natural Cream by Benjamin Moore. I'm going to show you what makes this paint color a grayish paint color and how it reacts to lighting. Also, I'm going to give you some valuable insight that you need to know about natural cream before deciding to paint this color in your home. Grayish paint colors are complicated for a lot of reasons, and I'm going to talk about that in a minute. But the first thing I want to show you is what makes natural cream a grayish. So watch this. When I get natural cream and I compare it with Chantelay Lace, notice the cool beige in natural cream. Now, when I compare this with a beige paint color called Feathered Down by Benjamin Moore, notice the gray undertone in natural cream. This is what makes this paint color a grayish. Now, when it comes to lighting, it's important that you get this right because if you don't, it could end up being a costly mistake and I don't want that to happen to you. So, for those of you that are thinking about painting this color in a south facing room, it's going to look like a tan cool beige. It's absolutely beautiful. Now, if you're thinking about painting this in a north facing room or any room that doesn't receive a lot of natural lighting, it's going to be a lot darker. You're going to see more of a gray and it's going to become like a gray cool beige. And this is why it's so important to get this right. Now, I want to share with you a couple of valuable tips. Number one, a grayish paint color is usually always 20 to 30% darker than an off-white paint color. Tip number two, anytime that you're dealing with a grayish paint color, they're all unique. So don't be surprised if you see a little bit of a green, sometimes a beige, or a gray undertone. And tip number three, anytime I'm creating a color palette for any of my online clients, I always make sure that I layer a grayish paint color with other neutrals or a pop of color because it's going to make the room feel cohesive as if everything belongs together. And when you do this right, it's absolutely stunning. How many of you have painted your home a grayish paint color and how did it turn out for you? Let me know in the comment section down below. I want to hear your story. And for those of you that are looking to paint your home right the first time and you want to avoid from making a costly mistake, then I highly recommend you to check out the link that's right below this video. It's going to take you to my website and I'm going to show you how I can help you regardless where you may live in North America. And feel free to check out the reviews and if you haven't subscribed to this channel, feel free to subscribe if you want to learn more about interior and exterior paint colors. Until then, I'll see you in the next video.